Hey, see, Lucky back with another movie, you feel me, I'm saying? I had to just make this video real quick, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? Keep your head up. When you walk, keep your head up. Don't walk with your head down. When you walk with your head down, you don't know what's in front of you. It could be a blessing right in front of you, but you walking with your head down. When you walk with your head down, you don't see nothing in front of you. When you walk with your head up, you see everything. You see what's down, you see what's up, you see what's in front of you, you see on, you see what's on the side of you, you see what's on that side, like, walk with your head up. Accept yourself. I'm saying, I was, I walked past a lady, she walking with her head down, looking at her stomach. You gotta accept that stomach. You gotta love that stomach. I'm saying? Time like that, you can't get that back. <laughs> You can't get time like that, spending time with family back. I'm saying every moment is a moment we can't get back. Like this moment right here, I can't get it back. That's why I recorded a video. Like when I watch these videos of mine, it's gonna unlock a memory inside of my, my mind. It's gonna unlock a memory. You feel me? It's gonna it's going to help me show gratitude when I'm going through tough times. It's going to help me appreciate the ones I got around me way more, way much more. Because, like, life, life is like a, it's a journey. And when you're on a journey of life, it's like you lose people. I'm saying you lose people. People, like, they come and go. Like, people... They get sick. They get sick. Even though there's no such thing as death, people get sick, people get hurt, and they are sent to the next life. But that doesn't mean we gotta cry about that person's death. We gotta celebrate that person's death because that person just completed this lifetime. They completed Earth. They completed Earth. Now they can move on. I hope so. I hope they can move on to the next life. Hope they can move on to the next life and the next life and the next life. Cause life, it's just a miracle. It's a miracle, man. So, every second of your life, don't, don't spend time thinking about the past. Don't spend time worrying about the future. Just spend time in the present moment. Spend time enjoying Enjoying what you, whatever you're doing. I'm saying you with friends, enjoy being with friends. If you with family, enjoy being with family. Like, make the best of memories. Do something funny. Do something crazy. Say some out-of-the-pocket shit. I'm saying, like, be yourself every single where you go. If you a funny person, be funny everywhere you go. Because you funny, that's you. It's in you. It's not on you, it's in you. If you a person that like to dance, dance every single where you go. It's not on you. It's in you. If you a person that talk a lot, talk every single where you go. Talk to everybody every single where you go. Be like, hello, you know what I'm saying? How you doing? How you doing? Oh, you, you looking nice today. You know what I'm saying? Spread that. Spread that love. Because I realized that when we spread love, we spread positivity. It's like it manifests through people. You know what I'm saying what I'm doing is manifesting through people. It manifests through. It's like it manifested. Now that person ready to carry that on, whatever, wherever they, wherever that person go, they gonna carry that positive energy, that loving energy. They gonna carry that on, and they gonna spread it. It's gonna become a virus. The shit we do become a virus. Like the shit we really do, it be so powerful, and we don't really, really, we don't really, like, understand it in a certain type of way. It's like we can do something that's so big. That we can't even wrap our minds around it. That's how powerful it is. I'm saying? You gotta love your power. You gotta love your body. You gotta love every single thing unconditionally. If you got a friend that's around you, they not taking their life serious. They just wanna party. They just wanna hang. They just wanna do bad habits all every day. You gotta... Tell that friend what it is and just walk out their life. Because in order to people, in order for someone to wake up, you have to give them, give them a wake-up call by walking out their life. 
The only way they're going to wake up is by you walking out their life. That's the only way they're going to wake up. That's the only, that's the only way they're going to snap out that trends. That's the only way they're going to snap out that trends. That's the only way they're going to snap them out. That's the only way. Because once you walk out their life, it's going to change their life forever. They're going to understand that like, I can't play. I can't play. That's, that, that was my blessing. That was my blessing. By, they, by them walking out my life, they saved my life. You know what I'm saying? We save people's lives by walking out their lives. We don't. We don't. We don't. We don't just help people by just staying in their life. We help people by just walking out their life. We save that person's life by just walking out that person's life. If that makes sense. In this world, you got to make things make sense to you. Or you forever going to be lost. Because you your own teacher. You could talk just like this. You could do anything you want to do. And I think we all got to that point where we understand that we could do anything we want to do. We understand that. You your own teacher. You, you a teacher and a student at the same time. You a teacher and a student at the same time. But you got to learn... You got to be willing to learn. You got to be willing to be teachable. It's like in sports, you got to be willing to be teachable. You got to be willing to be yelled at. Even if it's not in a disrespectful way. If that person just raising their voice a little a, a little bit, but they're not raising their voice to harm you, they just raising their voice to really get you to lock the fuck in. Like, yeah, because that coach believe in you. That coach know when they yell at you or use a high... Pitch of tone of voice, you wanna lock the fuck in. You wanna click back into reality and understand who you are. Understand who you are. You feel me? Cause all of y'all can do, like all of y'all. It's all of, like all of every single person. Every single person plays a role. Every single person plays a role in a sport. You just gotta play your role. If you a shooter, shoot. If you a running back, run the ball. Like if you're a quarterback, throw the ball. Play your role. Be who you are. Be who you are. Once you be who you are, it's like, oh my fucking gosh. It's like, oh my gosh. Like, damn, you're not going to be surprised because you know that's you. you know I'm saying you know it's you. When something is you, don't let nobody take it away from you. Don't, don't let nobody take what's yours. Don't let nobody take what's yours. Stand for up for what you believe in. If you believe in a religion, stand up for your religion. If you believe in <laughs> whatever you believe in, whatever you believe in, if you believe in your sister, stand up for your sister. If you believe in your your mom, stand up for your mom. If you believe in trees, like you know what I'm saying, stand up for trees. Whatever you believe in, you got to stand for it. You got to stand for it. You got to really stand for it. That's a solid foundation when you stand for something. People want to respect you on a whole new level when you stand for something. People want like, yeah, he not playing. He really stand for this. He really do this. He really do this. I promise every single thing you do, it don't go unnoticed. It don't go unnoticed. Think about this world. It's an illusion. It's an illusion. You don't know who really watch your videos. You don't know who really watch you play. You don't know who really like, you know what I'm saying? You don't know who really know you. Not even know you. Nobody know you, but you don't know who know of you. you know what I'm saying, you don't know who know of you. you know what I'm saying, people people respect you on a whole new level when you just not afraid to be alone. When you not afraid to be alone. When you not afraid to do what you want to do. When you not afraid to say what you want to say. People respect you on a whole new level because it's like damn, like. This nigga, he has no filter. He don't give a fuck. He just living his life like any other brother, any other normal person on earth. He just living his life, but he just doing it in a unique way. You know I'm saying everything we do is in a, it's in a unique way. Everything we do is unique. Every single thing we do is unique. You got to accept your weird sides. You got to accept that you are unique. You got to accept that you are different. I had to accept that. I had to accept that I'm different. I had to accept that I talk weird. I had to accept that I talk funny. I had to accept that I look a certain way. 
I had to accept this because it's beautiful. The things we don't want to accept, it'd be beautiful. That's the sad, honest truth. That's the sad, honest truth they hide from us our whole entire life that it's really beautiful. It's really beautiful. You feel me? But I swear I say, I love you. I love, I love everybody. Everybody. You more powerful than you think you are. You are more talented than you think you are. You are more smart than you think you are. You are more intelligent than you think you are. You feel me? So, I always play the fool. I always play the fool. When you play the fool, you beat the fool at his own game. When you play dumb, you beat them at their own game. Silence. Silence. Silence is everything. It's chess, not checkers. It's chess, not checkers. It's chess, not checkers. It's silence. It's silence. When you be silent, people expose themselves. When you make that move, they're going to expose how they really feel about you. <laughs> you feel me? So, you know what I'm saying? I love y'all, man. I really love y'all from the bottom of my heart. Thank y'all for watching this movie. And it's like, everything just seems so like a, it's like a memory. It's like a memory. And it, and it seems like a show. I feel like I'm being recorded 24-8. Like, really 24-8. So it's like, <laughs> they gonna record me? I feel like a movie character. I'm not gonna cap, bro. But I love y'all, man. I'm trying to wait till the video gets to like 12, 12. I normally do this just so it like it's like a divine message, a divine download, a divine movie, a divine video, whatever you want to call it. But y'all know my name. My name is AC Luggy, aka AC Coats. You dig what I'm saying?